here. You know, within the first two minutes of being back on Earth, I saw more people's faces than I had seen in a year. So that was really exciting. And to, it's just fun to interact with people again. That may be an understatement, given that American astronaut Christina Cook now holds the record for the most consecutive days in space, 328. A span during which she physically interacted with just a few other people, fellow astronauts with whom she shared very close quarters aboard the International Space Station. Thumbs up and a huge smile. Cook returned to Earth last Thursday, and while she was allotted for her feet, she hopes it's not too long before another woman rockets past her milestone. And I've always said about any record that you set that my biggest hope is that it's exceeded as soon as possible. That means we're pushing the boundaries. More people are living to, up to their dreams and their potential. So my main message to anyone who has a dream is to follow your passions, be true to yourself, do what you love, and live the life that you've imagined for yourself. Cook also led the first all-female spacewalk in October with fellow NASA astronaut Jessica Meir when they stepped out of the space station at the same time. Her 328-day mission gave insight on how weightlessness and space radiation affect the female body on long missions. So far, so good. But what I have noticed is that my balance has taken a little while to get used to. So the physical act of walking was something to get used to, but I'm feeling great. The next step for a female astronaut could be the moon. So I like to say that I'm just excited that I'll probably know the first woman and uh, the next man to walk on the surface of the moon. But any of us would be ready and honored to accept that mission if it were offered to us. But for the time being, Cook said she is enjoying life back in her hometown of Galveston, Texas, with its earthly luxuries of trips to the beach, munching on chips and salsa, spending time with her pooch, and gravity.